COVID-19 is a virus uh, in the coronavirus class that uh, essentially settles in the respiratory tract. And as it does so, it causes significant inflammation in the lungs, which necessitates the sometimes need for mechanical ventilation or ventilator support for those patients while they recover from the disease. The device that we're bringing to market is something called Vesper. It's actually very simple. It's truly designed only for use uh, in the indication of patients uh, when we run out of ventilators. When we run out of that one-on-one -on -one opportunity, uh, this is something that we can use during the time of the pandemic. As we've heard from Italy, uh, they are out of ventilator support and they are actually having to make decisions based on age or other conditions on who lives and dies without ventilator support. This will allow us to expand a single ventilator to deliver um, breathing to four patients simultaneously um, if the patients are relatively well matched with regard to their clinical parameters. Bringing Vesper to fruition really took a village, and it's the work of Ryan Ferris, his wife, Dr. Sarah Ferris, an emergency room physician, and Dr. Antine Stenbet, who is a pulmonologist. Dr. Ferris came up with the idea of the device, and they reached out to Clemson University. Ryan worked with uh, engineering teams to uh, come up with the right materials uh, and the right design that would fit all of our universal tubing. And then we worked with our university partners at Clemson and the University of South Carolina to get some models printed and get it tested in our simulation labs. They came to me just a few days ago to say, can you help us navigate the FDA approval process? And it was like Friday night at 10 o'clock. By Saturday, we had a meeting with the agency, with their team. And then by uh, today, we received emergency approval, which is three days later. The device will be free. Uh, it was clearly the intent of the uh, engineers and founding team. You get the best of all worlds. Um, I can draw on the best of the University of South Carolina. I can draw on the best of Clemson. And I can draw on one of the best health systems that I know of, Prisma Health. We are working with our university partners as well as other uh, industry partners in the community to get these manufactured. So we've reached out to several corporations. The response has been overwhelmingly positive. Uh, turnaround times, answers to emails from the very top within a few minutes, 30 minutes. So it's heartwarming to see that even during this crisis that people are just really pulling together. We've seen the best of the best of humanity over the past three days. Hopefully the long-term vision for Vesper is very short. Uh, we would love all of this to go away. Um, we would love all of this to not need ventilators for our patients. Um, it will be uh, a wonderful day, the day we don't have to print another one.